class, we're going to do some measuring today. If you have some linking cubes, I'd like for you to get out some linking cubes. And then I'd like for you to find some fun objects to measure. <laughs> Let's have fun measuring. When we measure how long something is, we say we're measuring the length. And if we measure how wide something is, we say we're measuring its width. Let's measure length and width today. Class, let's use our linking cubes to measure some items. I have put together some linking cubes. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We could even count them by two. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Hmm. What should we measure? I have a marker. Let's see how long the marker is. It is one, two, three, four, five, six cubes long. I put six cubes together. Let's put our marker right there. It is six cubes long. Hmm, what else could I measure? What about these scissors? How long are the scissors? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They are seven cubes long. I'm going to put those up here as well. All our scissors are seven cubes long. Can we measure this square? Hmm, how wide is the square? Let's take a closer look. The square is one, two, three, four cubes long. What about my clock? Can you see how wide my clock is? Let's count it. One, two, three, four, five, six. The clock is six squares long. I only have one more thing to measure. <gasps> Look how long my pointer is. Oh no! My cubes did not form a long enough line to measure it. What could I do? Hmm, what if we added some more cubes? Let's count and see how long my pointer is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. It's 19 cubes long. I would love for you to measure some things today. You could use cubes or maybe Lego or even cereal. You could see how many Cheerios long your spoon is. Have a wonderful time practicing, measuring. Have a great day class. Bye-bye.